Brazil's a great team, and they have such a different formation that it, it poses for a threat in terms of the counterattack. And, uh, you know, Bueller unfortunately gets that red card, and whether that's questionable or not is irrelevant because you just have to go on. And, and then, of course, like the, the penalty that Hope saves, um, I think that they said that one of our players encroached into the into the penalty box, and then of course they finish that goal and and then score the go ahead goal and in, in, in extra time. We had some chances and to play down a man uh, for more than half the game is pretty amazing. First of all, very emotional. So many things happening in that game. It was a long game, but also a little bit of a tactical as well. Uh, we had to make a decision when uh, Ray Shibula was sent off, how to deal with the back line and um, we decided to go with three in the back and stick with two up top. So, um, and with the way Le Pelbet, uh, Christy Rampone and Ali Krieger played helped this team quite a bit. I just kept feeling like if we just had one good opportunity, we would put it away. And I don't know, I didn't know it was going to be me. Um, I'm really proud of Megan for putting in maybe the most beautiful left-footed cross she's ever put in in her life and uh, just went over the keeper's hands, went over the defender's head and I was there to finish. There is something to be said about when you gather the team and you look in their eyes and it is possible. Uh, we play under pressure but we like that, embrace that and uh, the, the play came out huge. And uh, Meg Rampino plays that big ball. Abby won back at the end of that ball, and it's 2-2. Two -two. And not only that, then you have PKs. And composure and a determination that, okay, we are going to win. Uh, it's contagious. Uh, the players did a fantastic job. All the things were against us. And for us to still pull through, this is a special team. And it's something to be reckoned with. And uh, obviously, we have two more big games coming up. But this gives you the kind of confidence that just makes you feel like you can fly. Um, I'm proud to be part of this. First of all, enjoy the game. You have to enjoy what we just did. This is a unique situation. So I don't think it's a good idea to be too eager to go forward and look to the next game. So we have to enjoy this game. Tomorrow is another day. And then you try to get some fresh legs and prepare for, for the game and uh, against France. This is, this is historic. And, and I believe that this team will tomorrow morning, wipe the slate clean and move on to France because this isn't good enough. We haven't won anything. We won a game and that's it. We want to win the World Cup and that takes two more games. It's going to take a really good performance against France. Uh, they're a great team. They have many threats and, you know, I believe that this team can succeed if given enough opportunities. And we kind of just showed that resilience and the character about that tonight.